their support following last week's brutal knife attack. Speaking to reporters before leaving the hospital on Tuesday, the U.S. envoy said in Korean that the incident will only strengthen ties between Seoul and Washington. Ambassador Lippert, who was attacked by a man wielding a knife at a breakfast meeting in central Seoul last week, needed 80 stitches on his right cheek and left arm. The stitches on his face have been removed, but doctors will be visiting his home every day to check on his arm until he is fully recovered. All things considered, the envoy says he feels pretty darn good. I mean, it was uh, obviously a scary incident, but I'm walking, talking, uh, holding my baby, uh, uh, you know, hugging my wife. Um, so I'm, I just feel really good. But he did hint at a possible change in the security procedures, as many blamed lack security for his injuries. At the time of the attack, the ambassador only had one full-time South Korean bodyguard with him. Uh, but obviously, uh, as people and the State Department in Washington has, have said, we're going to take a hard look uh, at uh, our tactics, techniques, procedures here, and I'll leave it to the security experts to come up with uh, recommendations and policies going forward. The ambassador, with a mix of Korean words, asked the South Korean public to treat him as they had done before the incident, as the guy next door and Sejun's dad. I will still be 